This is Susan Phillips getting a rapid COVID-19 test. She's doing so because it's now part of Homestead of Knoxville's rules. You must take one if you want to go see your loved one who lives inside. And for the past year, Phillips says she was mostly seeing her mother-in-law, who she calls her mother, through this window or at farther distances. So we've seen her talk to her through the windows. We had a my youngest son's wedding, so she was able to come out here and we stayed across the street. And so she was a part of the the wedding picture on that one. But yeah, it's the first time I'm actually going to be physically with her in the same room. About 15 minutes after her rapid COVID-19 test, which was negative, Phillips was on her way back to see her mother. And I couldn't follow her in, but I did catch up with Phillips and her mother using the same method they used to communicate for nearly a year. This window. This is the first time that you all have been this close in almost a year. What does it feel like? I, I want to give her a hug and a not touching or staying six feet apart is one of the rules the home has to keep residents safe. But Christina says it's not going to stop her from one of her favorite activities. Talk. And the home's marketing director says allowing visitors back inside came about because the majority of residents are now vaccinated. So this was our, our time and our ability to say we're looking at the evidence. We're looking at, at what our buildings are experiencing, and we feel comfortable making this move cautiously. And Philip says being this close to her mother was exciting. And she says for anyone waiting for the chance to get physically close to their loved one again. It's going to happen. Um, 